Prince William wants to return to the NHS as an air ambulance pilot to do his bit in the fight against the deadly coronavirus as it continues to rip across Britain. The Duke of Cambridge, who flew as a medic for two years with the East Anglian Air Ambulance until 2017, has suggested he misses it. The 37-year-old royal is understood to have made the confession during a visit to a NHS call centre in Croydon, South London, earlier this month. A source told The Sun, William has been seriously considering returning as an air ambulance pilot to help in the current pandemic. He knows the whole country is doing its bit and he wants to help. But it's complicated as he was originally grounded from the job so that he could become a senior working royal. That role is even more important now given that Charles has been ill, Harry has walked away with Meghan and Andrew has been effectively barred from public life. But William is very keen to do anything he can to help. It comes as Prince William is seeing out the public health crisis at Anmer Hall in Norfolk with his wife Kate, 38, and children George, 6, Charlotte, 4, and Louis, 1. His father Prince Charles, 71, was on Monday let out of self-isolation a week after being diagnosed with the coronavirus. The Queen, 93, and Duke of Edinburgh, 98, are in good health and staying away from public life as they keep to themselves in Windsor Castle. Meanwhile Prince Harry, 35, and Meghan Markle, 38, have shunned their family during the crisis and are living in Los Angeles after scurrying across the border from Vancouver Island, Canada, before it shut. Prince William worked as a pilot for the East Anglian Air Ambulance for 18 months between 2015 and 2017 before stepping down to take on more royal roles on behalf of the Queen. This could be the problem for the Prince as his jam-packed schedule may make it hard for him to take on further responsibilities. But the source claimed that if the senior royal was to reprise his role, he is currently in the right place to do it in Norfolk. Earlier this month, William became the patron of the London Air Ambulance Charity, which was established in 1989, and provides rapid emergency care in the capital. As patron, the Duke of Cambridge is set to champion the important work carried out by the group across the capital. A statement from Kensington Palace, the Prince's official residence, read, His Royal Highness has seen firsthand the impact these first responders have upon the lives of patients with critical injuries. Last year, the father of three was patron of London Air Ambulance's 30th anniversary campaign for the duration of 2019. In January 2019, he visited the Royal London Hospital in Whitechapel, where he met with clinicians, paramedics, pilots and crew members and piloted the helicopter the London Air Ambulance kept there on standby. In November of the same year, he attended the charity's gala and was hailed one of their own by the staff in attendance. Jonathan Jenkins, the CEO of London's Air Ambulance Charity, said, we are honoured that the Duke of Cambridge has chosen to become patron of London's Air Ambulance Charity after getting to know us last year. The Duke truly understands our work and knows that every second counts in an emergency. He added, We know that with his help as well as the continued support of the public, our crews can reach those who need them most, serving the people of London 24 hours a day, every day of the year. William took up the position as pilot for the East Anglian Air Ambulance Service in July 2015, and worked there until his last shift in 2017. He left the role to spend more time in London when his children started school at Thomas's, Battersea, and take on more royal duties to support the Queen. In a statement at the time, issued on his behalf by Kensington Palace, he said it was a privilege to fly with the organization. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have already weighed in to help Britons who have been affected by the coronavirus. On Saturday they revealed they were launching a pound five million scheme with the charity Minds to support the nation's mental health at a time of high anxiety during the lockdown. They urged people to follow guidance from Public Health England by using video calls to keep in touch with family and friends sticking to regular routines and focusing on their favorite hobbies or trying to learn something new. The Cambridge's intervention is part of a government initiative that will see pound five million awarded to mental health charities to expand support services. They wrote, 
self-isolation and social distancing can pose huge challenges to our mental health. In recent weeks the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have been in regular contact with organizations and patronages to understand the issues they are facing during this difficult time. MIND is one of a consortium of charities preparing to adapt and increase their services during the lockdown.